welcome to the project demonstration of iot smart delivery robots so here we can deliver the any items like in the swiggy or any parcels with help of this motor uh, robots and that will be controlled through the iot by seeing the visuals from our robot camera so here we use the esp32 camera for video transmissions and also it will take the commands from the browser through iot this forward backward left right and stop and also there is a headlight on off so we can control the headlight also for uh, in a night mode and unlock lock so right so when we are sending this robot to deliver the package so once it reaches the uh, location delivery location then when we press the unlock here the system will display the enter the password so the user already provided the password when he enter the password correct password then this door will opens as a package delivery and after that uh, after some time it will close automatically and we can control the robot movement again so whenever the obstacle detects the robot start moving in forward direction and the blue lights will get switched on and also it has a one more feature like theft detection if any vibrations heavy vibrations detected on this robot body the system will detect that and it will provide the buzzer alert, buzzer alert continuously <coughs> so let us see the inside of this robot so we are using pic 16f 877a 40 pin microcontroller which will taking uh, input from the input module esp32 camera and sr04 ultrasonic sensor so here this is the esp32 camera and sr04 ultrasonic sensor so these are the two main inputs so these in, uh, inputs are connected at pin number c4 c5 c6 c7 and uh, sr04 ultrasonic sensor at a0 a1 and keypad also so the keypad interface at b0 to b7 and the next the output modules are like buzzer uh, interface at the uh, d0 and the d1 d2 for this leds headlights and blue leds which are attached here and the next c0 to c3 to robot movement so here we have interface the six dc motors of 60 rpm 12 volts operated so that was interface at this l298 motor driver and that was it c0 to c3 and next d4 d5 interface at the l293d so this l293d is to control this unlock and locking of this dc motor l29h for robot movement and the whole system getting power supply from this 12 volt uh, 4 amps lithium ion battery which is rechargeable so in order to recharge the battery we are going to making use of a charger so right we need to connect this b at this B slot and on the power supply to this transformer power cable to 30 volts plug so when we on that there will be a LED indication which will show the status of battery is charging once the battery is fully charged so it will take 6 to 8 hours of time and after that you can disconnect that if you forgot to disconnect that also no need to worry these diodes will block the current flow from the battery to the transformer when the battery is fully charged so that we can protect the charger and the battery also from overcharging and this is slider setup attached to the L293D motor driver so we have interfaced the LCD display port number A and E and here we can see the buzzer sorry uh, this is a vibration sensor which can detect the vibrations when uh, anyone is trying to tap that so keep this cable underneath and close the latch right so this is a main on off switch right so before on the kit we need to do some initial steps so install a network analyzer application so this icon available in the play store and next change the hotspot name to project 5673 all are small letters i'm repeating that without any space without any capital letter and password should be 12345678 ap band should be 2.4 gigahertz so these three are very important before on the kit check twice before on the hotspot so on the hotspot and previously just have a switch on the gate that's why it's connected one device so now go to network another application right so on the gate so options go to land scan do scan here so whenever the obstacle detects then automatically the light is getting on so it's normal now 
so one is your mobile phone IP address another is our express ESP uh, 3 to camera copy that and go to the browser paste here enter right so we are getting the visuals directly so let us see on the floor right so we can see the visuals from the robots so while you are controlling forward direction so just click on that forward so if any obstacle detects then automatically the blue lights will get switched on and till the obstacle moves it will keep on off state only stop right same like for backward also So while moving back also if an obstacle detects automatically the light will get switched on stop left side left and right we should hold the switch left <coughs> so once it reaches the destination then yeah right we can see the headlight also right headlight on and off right so when we press the unlock so the blue lights will get switched on and the lcd will ask for the password so we are uh, demonstrating with one two three four password right so we can keep package inside the robot once the delivery completes then automatically the lights will be off